There you are. We were actually getting a little worried that something had happened, as we get got Alex's message a while ago. While Lisa and I were waiting, we went over the plan. It seems that security has been improved here. There are more guards than before. Yeah, Alex did mention it. Maybe not as easy as we thought. Lots of guards now. Uh, while we are waiting for Alex to finish with her mom's writing lesson, we can do some recon. From a purely practical point, how do you actually steal a barge? Let's spy on them first. Rose, Linda, if you stay here and wait for Alex, Rose and I will... Um, Oh. Rose and I will ride along each side of the beach and do some recon. I don't think they'll pay it much attention to a couple of girls riding along the beach. But we can't look too curious or get too close. Uh, okay. Oh, Alex here! Alex, you made it! And we're not weird at all that we're just standing over here. Now that Alex has joined us, we're ready to go on. How did I it go for you, Rose? Did you find anything useful? It seems that all the barges are pretty well guarded. It looks harder than we thought. Dark Core's presence is overwhelming and there's a lot of activity on the beach. There are far too many guards up down here. If we, and even if we manage to snatch a bar, I have no idea how to get it started. I think that ha perhaps we need to think about this point. What do you think? Hmm. I don't know. Oh well, let's tackle one problem at a time. We can't just gallop up to the barge and take it because we can't start it anyway. Mm. In any case, uh, we should see uh, we shouldn't see starting the barge as a major problem. If we manage to get on board, I promise that I can hotwire it. I might just need a little time, uh, but no, we can't just storm the barge and think that we can sail away just like that. Hmm. But how do we sneak on board unnoticed? If we could just fool them somehow by wearing a disguise or something. <laughs> I like how you think, but I don't think they are so stupid that they will be fooled by us wearing dark glasses and green coats. Mm -hmm. I have an idea. Miss Holsworth, who lives in the red cottage over there, is, is our solution. Bana. What do you mean, Lisa? Mm -hmm. Linda. Uh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I once borrowed a book from Miss Holsworth that was about transformation. Metamorphosis. Mm -hmm. Meta what? Mm -hmm. Metamorphosis. The book was about how you could transform yourself into someone else with some sort of potion. The magical disguise is easy to see through for those who are really sharp as a recall as I recall, but it, in this case it sh could really work. <laughs> is it even possible? <laughs> it's worth giving it a try. Miss Holsworth lives right here. Let's ask her. If we are lucky, she may actually be able to help us with a portion potion that turns us into dark core minions effectively enough to so we can sneak on board their barge. Uh -huh. Okay. If this works, we can actually transform into dark core's workers. It shouldn't too should it shouldn't be too difficult to get on board and take care of control of the barge so that we can go and pick up Justin. Come on, there's no time to lose. Two Miss Holdsworths. Last one there is a rotten egg. Uh, what? But, ah! Damn it. I don't want to be a rotten egg! Uh, I'm always the rotten egg. Boy. I'm here. Uh, yes, gonna turn around. Uh, good afternoon, my dears. What are you all doing here together, and what's the hurry? You have a me me good memory, Linda. I remember it was a while ago that you borrowed and read that book. But uh, to answer your question, yes, there is a way to disguise yourself using a magical transformation. Pay attention. 
Okay. Your plan is bold, but it could work. The metamorphosis, the transformation is, however, quite unstable. Unfortunately, the magic is easy to see through. If you are on the lookout, moreover, the effect doesn't last for long. But just like you, I think that these guys working for Dark Horde down there on the beach are pretty gullible anyway. There is a lot to prepare and I am, I am missing a few ingredients. This will take some time, I'm afraid, girls. Of course, Miss Holford, we can help you prepare whatever you need help with and we can pick up the stuff you are missing. Thank you m so much, Linda. I'm missing three ingredients. The first is ice pistols from the frozen parts of the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur. The second is a swamp water with a light uh, reflection of a well of the wisp from the cauldron swamp. The third ingredient is an algae that can be found on the rocky beaches of South Hoof. The places are really scattered about. How about we split up so we can gather the ingredients faster? Yeah, let's do that. I can stay here and help Miss Holsworth with the preparations. Aww. I can ride to Port Fort Pinta and take the ferry to South Hoof and get the Alge. Mm -hmm. Cool! Tinkan and I are psyched to ride to the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur and look for the Ice Tillstones, aren't we, Tinkan? Oh. Brilliant! Rose, you'll ride to the Cauldron Swamp mm -hmm. in the Golden Hills Valley and fetch the swamp water there then. Mm. See you later then! So we're going to the swamp! Yay! Why did we get the... Okay, anyway. Now, we know what we have to get and are, and are in the process of doing that. Lisa and Alex are already on their way. Miss Holsworth, what can I help you with? Mm. Rose, I'm helping Miss Holsworth with the preparation here to save time. But you ride to Golden Hills Valley and the Cauldron Swamp to get the swamp water with the reflection of Will of the Wisp in it. Uh, watch it so you don't fall in when you are collecting the swamp, fo swamp wa water and above all don't come into contact with the will of the wisp itself. It likes to lure visitors into the deadly swamp water. Don't let yourself be fooled. Finding a place where, to, where the will of the wisp is reflected in the black water shouldn't be hard. It's just a matter of finding a good place with a good angle toward the glowing will of the wisp. Here, take the glass bottle to collect the water. See you back here again soon. Okie dokie. Ah, the bee sound is freaking me out. Okie dokie. So now I think it is better to actually take the transport to Jasper and run from there. Ugh, okay. Uh, yes, for pumpkin farm. My nose is like itching or something. So annoying. Okay. To the swamp! Ah! That didn't go well. Now, to the swamp! <laughs> mm -hmm. And run up the hills, these hills that are so boring, so so boring to ride upon. Oh, they're so dull. La 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 Okay, so we need to get the water. And... You have now reached the cauldron swamp. Better be careful. Miss Holford needs swamp water for the cauldron swamp. Fill the bottle where the light from the will of the wisp is reflected. Use the bottle you brought with you. Yes, I know. Why do you remind me? But thank you anyway for reminding me. Jumpy jump. Jumpy jump. Okay, so there is a place over here. Ah, stop. Thank goodness. Forcey. Okay, there we go. Where are you going? Thanks you. 
Now, they say that we shouldn't, but I am anyway. Push! He's such a hero, Jarvis, isn't he? Let's get back to Miss Hillsworth. Ah! Come on. It wasn't that bad. We're going back. Back to back to back. Is it the old guy here? No, no, it's not. Hmm. Oh, there was a. Bleh. Mew. Okay. What? Okay. That was not epic at all. <laughs> Sorry, but no. Back to Moreland. We're gonna look like those fools. Gonna be fun. So down. Ah, turn it up. Moreland Station. Okay. I heard it. Beep. <laughs> that was so cute. Okay, we have the water and they're back and I'm slow and oh boy. Magic. E epic. Thank you, my dear. Fine droplets. The others are already here, so we will be waiting for you. I'm sorry for being slow. While this is simmering in the cauldron, I have something to tell you. Because I have something very special for you. Listen carefully. I have a dozen sleep bombs that you can have. Perhaps you've heard of the sleep bombs that many witches and shadow sorcerers use. These are of the same sort. You throw the glass bottle at wherever you want to fall asleep. Oh, that's perfect. This will be great when we come to free Justin. We have no idea what will happen to us there. This will... These will come in very handy. Exactly. Use them with extreme s caution and only if you have to. Keep them for as long as you can. You never know when you will be really need them. Um. Uh, yes, and if our disguise doesn't work, then we have a plan B with the help of these sleep bombs. Yes, it feels safer that you have them to know that you can defend yourself properly if you need to. It will keep me calm during the night. I can carry all the sleep bombs in the meantime. Okay. Well then, here you are, Lisa. Don't drop them or bump into anything. If any of these bottles break, everyone here will fall asleep straight away and it could actually be dangerous. Okay, please dismount your horses now. I think it's time for tasting. Um. Okay, give it to me. I want it. I think everything is ready now. Dismount your horses and come closer. It was a bit tricky to get this done so quickly for you, but you know what? My friends, thanks to Linda here, we won't have to wait until tomorrow. Woohoo! Everything is ready, but the drink won't taste very nice. Be careful now. Take a little sip to check the effect. Remember to focus on the person you want to be disguised as when you drink this. That's the person you're going to look like. <gasps> Thanks so much, Miss Holdsworth. Let's check that this actually works. Remember only a small sip and focus on the Dark Core minions. Okay, on three. Yes, one, two, three. Now we'll see. I'm drinking with my nose. I look amazing. No! Alex! Oh. Alex? <laughs> but Alex! Oh no, sorry, I started thinking about justice as we're going to rescue him. That wasn't the intention. <laughs> I'll try again. Oh, the face palming. Okay, great. Now. There. Testing completed. 
No, okay. No, I wanna go. Okay, fine. Um, it worked really well. N next time, I'll be more careful and really focus on the right. Uh, uh, okay, why are everyone on horses? Who am I supposed to? Oh. Uh, thanks so much for your help, Miss Holsworth. An extra big thank you for the sleep bombs. We really have to go now. Rose, Linda, and Alex, now we'll ride down to the Moreland Beach. Let's go steal a barge. Oh, wait, no, wait for me. Come on, Jarvis, we need to hurry. Uh, bye, Miss Holdsworth. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, this is so exciting. Ah, wrong, sorry, I'll be on the other side. There we go. Okay, everyone, it's time. Dismount, everyone. Uh, wrong. Rocket, you stay here, or, or you will be too obvious. Hello. The plan is for Rose and Lisa to walk up to the guards and loudly explain that they have been given orders from the highest authority to transport four horses to the headquarters. While you are talking, Alex and uh, will I board, and I will board the barge with our horses and try to start the barge engine. When you have finished shouting to the guard, you'll board with your horses, okay? Is everyone ready? We'll only get one shot at this. Yes! Remember that we have to focus on the right person now. I'm ready. Good, I'll count. One, two, three. Drink! Oh my god, I'm drinking so... Oh yeah, oh boy. Yeah, this is not obvious at all. What do you want? What do you are transporting horses? Uh, worker 137 here. Yes, I'm bringing new orders. Could we borrow a barge, old man? <laughs> Me, Alex, Linda, and oops, I mean, M. Um. <laughs> okay, so first one. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh my god! And uh, no one saw that. No one saw it. New orders? What orders? Uh, Cemetery Free has sent us to transport some horses. Uh, okay, this one. And here comes Linda. <laughs> and he saw nothing. Okay. A barge to transport horses. I'm just going to check the papers. Oh, never mind that. I, it can't be important. Uh, these are the not the horses you're looking for. Um, you may have the wrong papers. Oh, never mind. I can't be bored. <laughs> Let's be. Okay. No! <gasps> oh! Oh boy! We have an issue! No! Oh boy! Oh! Lisa threw the sleeping bombs. That was close. I could have used a couple of sleep bombs. They obviously work well. Oh! Get on horse. Ah! Uh, watch out! There's more guards running over from the beach. We have to defend the boat from here. We can't get aboard right now. Rose, here, take a bunch of sleep bombs and help me keep the guards away from the barge. Yes. We're struggling to get the bo barge started. Oh. I'll, f I'll fix it soon. Stay strong, keep the guards away from us. Oh. Lisa, Rose, watch out. Lots of guards are coming along the beach. Keep them away from the barge. Uh, oh boy. So we're supposed to throw them. Throw. Guard coming. There we go. I remember that there was some issue sometimes with this quest. People were having, they like couldn't throw anything or they had, uh, something was wrong with it, so. 
Oh, ah! But now it seems to be working, so everything is fine. <clears throat> yep. I am good at tossing these bombs. You're safe. Linda. Linda and I are trying to get this miserable thing started. We need more time. Can you protect us from them or a while? Of course, but hurry. There are more and more of them. Hang in there. We're working as quick as we can. Alex, is there fuel line? Maybe you want the spanner? Uh. Oh boy! There are more of them! Uh. Ah! No! You go yeah. sleep. Ah! Yes, we got the engine started. Come on, everyone. Good work, Alex. Rose, Lisa, we got the boat started. Get on board now. We can't. There's too many of them. We will never make it unless you want all the guards on board, too. Go now and we'll try to start stop them from following you. Go to Fort Pinta Harbor. We'll see you in the Fort Pinta. This was trickier than I thought it would be. Okay, see you later at Fort Pinta Harbor. Bye! Oh boy, this is getting so exciting! I get it, they're leaving without us. Oh! Okay. Bye! Okay, we need to throw some more. Ah! Uh. Jesus, they're quick. Ah, boy, 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 Are we leaving? Uh -huh. They got the board started. Now we, mm, but now we are left here and we have no sleep bombs left. What? <gasps> this is not good. No sleep bombs left and more and more guards. We have to run. Come on, Rose. We have to try to shake them off. We'll run in different directions. Take right up there, okay? See you at Fort Pinta Harbor later. I don't like these kinds of games! <laughs> Run, Jarvis! Uh, how? No? How do they expect me to run there? I figured, I'm like, I can't run there. <laughs> I hope Lisa got away. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! I don't think anyone is chasing us. Are we good? I think we're good. Huh. Oh! Oh my! A traffic accident! I hope you're all fine. Run, Jarvis! Well, we're at Fort Pitta. Okay, running in here. Hmm. Ah! I think we've shaken them off. Ah! Where were we supposed to go there? Okay, okay. This one, this one, this one. Hey, yes, one mistake. Oh, hi, Lisa. How you go? Ah, oh. oh, phew. It looks like we've managed to shake them off. That was really close. I'm so annoyed that we had to use all the sleep bombs. Okay. We were really lucky to manage to shake off all the, the our core guards. Linda sent a message. They're hunting for another barge and have to take a detour. So. And they're hunting for another barge detour, so they'll probably not get here until tomorrow morning. 
Unfortunately, we can't do much more wi before Linda and Alex pick us up tomorrow. So now you and I have just have to just avoid all dark horse on the links and wait until tomorrow. Lay low, don't let any of the dark horse guards see you. Okay. <gasps> Make sure you rest up properly. Tomorrow we won't be able to rest until Justin has been saved and we're all back in safety. Oi. So we just have to wait. Okay. Well, I think it's good to end it here and I guess in the next episode, we are continuing this adventure. Ah, it's so exciting. But until next time, people, stay awesome as always. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.